Hey guys, welcome back to the Wall Street Bull Anthony here. I hope you're all doing well and staying safe out there. Massive shout out and thank you to every single one of you who have subscribed to the channel. I really appreciate it. You guys rock. I love talking with everyone in the comments and the community tab. So if you're new to this channel, please make sure you smash the subscribe button down there. Turn on that little bell notification as well because as you can see right here, I love documenting my journey with investing be through cryptos, dividend stocks, growth stocks, talking about passive income, building financial freedom. And yes, my goal at the end of the day is to build generational wealth. So come along this incredible journey. It's been insane so far. Also, so guys, if you can give this video a thumbs up, watch it straight through, it really help me push this channel out to a lot more people because the YouTube algorithm is magic. All right, guys, let's get straight into a little disclaimer. I am not a financial advisor. Please do your own research and due diligence with all this stuff. I do not I do not want to see anyone get financially hurt. Please jump on all the websites um, I have recommended in all my videos, Luna Crush, Reddit, Medium, TikTok, if you have to, just be careful on that. Google everything, use Twitter a lot because there's a lot of stuff on there that will help you as well. Also, just get confident before jumping into this investing. Me personally, my golden rule is I only invest what I can afford to lose. Yes, we don't like to lose, but you can lose money like that in cryptos, all right? So please be careful. Don't take what I say as financial advice. All right, guys, now the formalities are out of the way. Let's get straight into CoinSpot. This is where I buy my cryptos in Australia, by the way. Please feel free to use the referral link below if you're new to cryptos. And uh, you can get $10 in Bitcoin if you use that. Who doesn't want Bitcoin? It's only going to hit 100,000 to 150 very soon, guys. It's coming. This parabolic run uh, is coming, guys. Believe me. Let's get straight into it. All right. So Bitcoin is down 7%. The entire market's down today. Am I worried? No, not at all. Bitcoin is down 7%, guys, to $84,000. That is significant. It was up to nearly 90,000 Australian. By the way, this is all in AUD. I've got all my other apps set to US dollars, so I'm catering for everyone. So 84,000. Ethereum, $6,000, guys. BNB, $853. Solana, $317. Cardano, $2.72. That's a great buying opportunity. XRP, $1.57. This is crazy, man. Great buying opportunities. Polkadot, $59. Dogecoin's down 5%, $0.34. Shiba Inu, uh, keep scrolling down to my favorite projects. Anyway, Matic, $2.24. Algo is one that I'm going to talk about as well. $2.45. VeChain, $0.21. XLM Stellar, $0.50. Keep scrolling down here. Theta's at $9.20, guys. That's incredible. Hedera's at $0.57. Cents. Uh, what else have we got here? Decentraland Mana is at $4.25. Incredible buying opportunities, man. Neo's at $62. Keep scrolling down here. Eng, I'm going to add this one in my portfolio. I've been saying it for a while. $3.98. Sand is at $3.65 right now. And the other one I'm going to talk about today is Sinfin XDC, and that is at $0.12. Cents. That is an incredible buying opportunity right now, honestly. Let's go straight into my Explorer here because I've got some obviously some news updates here. Now, regarding this ISO 222 um, you know, compliance that's coming into uh, you know our world as we speak right now, it's coming earlier than 2030, which I had initially thought. It's coming in 2025, which is incredible. And if you go here, guys, ISO 222 is coming. How banks can prepare for the new payments messaging standard. This is an article on the 9th of November and we're at the 16th today, guys. Actually, yes, 16th. It's just been crazy. But uh, if you look here, this new payment system is coming into play. So, however, the move to the new standard is uh, there is no guarantee the transition will be smooth sailing. Yes, the migration deadline is estimated to be 2025. I had initially thought this was 2030, but it is now 2025, which is crazy because it's just brought forward everything that I've been saying in all my videos about these top banking coins and projects. Now, if you go to here, the, the five cryptos that you will need to consider if you're looking to get into these banking and crypto coins, obviously you need to do your own research and due diligence. But these projects are going to be solely reliant on banks and financial institutions. They're not going to be reliant on retail investors. And that's a big thing for me personally, because if you're not solely reliant on you know social media and hyping projects, it's going to be beneficial because all the money from these banks and financial institutions will be flowing through these projects. Now, for those of you who don't don't know obviously ISO 222 is the whole new banking system that's coming into play and you've got here the top five crypto projects XRP XDC XLM Stellar IOTA and Algorand now these are incredible projects obviously guys so these are the top five projects that you will need to consider 
in order to be a part of this ISO 222 new world of banking and finance, which is, you know, it's happening. They will flick the switch and all of this stuff will just come straight, uh, like literally overnight, and we will see the switch made to these cryptocurrencies being used as bridges between currencies and just, it's going to be a crazy new world, guys, and it is happening. I mean, if you look at the news today, now where's my news article that I just had up, guys, because it's crazy. Uh, here we go here, Investor Palace. No, not that one. That's pro. So I'm going to say Australia gears up for the crypto era. This is what I'm saying in terms of us being so early and, you know, with regards to adoption around the world. You think I'm worried about Bitcoin going down today? No, not at all, man. Uh, yes, some predictions are, you know, predicting obviously that uh, the, the end of the bull run is near. Look, that may be the case. Um, and obviously the crypto trend and the technical analysis charts are all pointing exactly as predicted for over the years. And uh, I did watch BitBoy before and he said, when in doubt, zoom out. And I like that quote because, you know, again, we're so early in this. All you need to do is zoom out and look at Bitcoin and all of the crypto market in general at a distance because that's where you're going to see the real benefit and just the constant rise. It's not like, you know, all of this all the time. It's, it's constantly going up in value. That's what you got to look at. Yes, there's dips and all that stuff. Don't be worried about that. Don't be scared. Don't panic. We're early in this, guys. Honestly, we really are. So if you check this out, this is a news update from crypto you know, in relation to Australian crypto adoption. A series of major developments in the crypto sector signal a new chapter in Australian finance. And obviously, this is going to be in the US, Europe, China, Africa, you know, Russia, all over the world, guys. It's happening. So a new chapter in Australian finance. Alongside a report out of the Australian Senate, CBA customers will be able to trade cryptos, which I did a video at CBA is one of the top four banks here. ASX gains its first crypto theme listing, the first of many. This is what I'm saying. Imagine when all this happens around the world with ETFs being approved globally, what's going to happen when institutional money flows in and these cryptos, the five that I've just mentioned to you, are used as bridges between banks and financial institutions. What do you think is going to happen? So I'm not worrying about the dip today at all, guys, but these five cryptos are the ones you've got to consider, again, that are obviously going to be partnering with the biggest banks and financial institutions in the world. It's happening, guys. They're part of the Digital Pound Foundation as well. It's all happening, guys. It really is. And another thing I want to point out as well, check this out. Herbert Smith and Freehills, one of the biggest law firms in the world. Incredible stuff here. So Herbert Smith Freehills partners with Digital Pound Foundation to support development of the UK's CBDCs and digital money ecosystem. Now, why would they have one of the biggest law firms on the planet joining up for the Digital Pound Foundation? Because obviously, you know, they're wanting a part of it. They're going to help regulate it and do whatever they need to do. But it's happening. So again, the Digital Pound Foundation and incredible, incredible projects, Electronium, Ripple, it's all happening, guys. And again, check this out right here. Why Ripple partnered with the Digital Pound Foundation to develop the CBDCs in the UK? Now, why would they be doing that? And obviously, this is all going on whilst this court case is happening with the SEC, which has been very quiet, mind you. So I'm not too concerned. Maybe something's brewing there, a settlement on the, on the horizon. Who knows, guys, but it's been very quiet in there. But anyway, if we keep reading here, so check this out here. Uh, where are we here, guys? We're excited to support the design and implementation of the Digital Pound Partnership at the Digital Pound Foundation. The foundation will help advance the UK's goal to build more inclusive and sustainable financial system. So the payment solution company has been approached, approaching several banking institutions worldwide to work on CBDCs from their design to, their, to policies necessary to implement them and other technical details. Ripple's unstoppable, man. It's one of these crazy projects. And, you know, if you're not in Ripple, well, that's obviously up your decision. But XRP is literally going to be a game changer as well as these other cryptocurrencies that, you know, that are part of this ISO 222 compliance and the new world that we're all, you know, in at the moment. It's crazy stuff, man. Just unbelievable. So that's pretty much my updates with regards to that. Now, another one that I did look into, and obviously was XPR, which is the uh, Proton chain. This is a project that I literally acquired last night and it was extremely difficult to acquire yes it's on kucoin you will need kucoin to uh, buy this project i did acquire it um it's not it's quite simple to buy this project on kucoin but it's transferring it out which is difficult because if you're transferring out to a wallet it doesn't necessarily work straight to you know from kucoin to like trust wallet or metamask or whatever ledger or nano s whatever you're using you need to transfer it out to their app 
their app is quite incredible guys and I'm going to show you this now so check this out this is their app so this is the XPR Proton wallet in order to get the coins um, you need to transfer them from KuCoin over to this XPR Proton wallet from here on the browser they've got an exchange where you can swap them out to your trust wallet or metamask or ledger nano wherever you wish to store them now obviously it's an incredible project and i'm just going to quickly show you this right now so built build on the proton the payment blockchain it's really un, it's really cool guys so the universal at name so every business or individual account on proton is has a unique human redeemable at name the name uh, need to send twenty dollars to at fred it's easier as you would expect so basically when you're transferring out to kucoin to your proton wallet you just put your at name so once you've set up your wallet you can have like at anthony at wall street bull or whatever it is all you do is put that in you literally pay no gas fees this is what's incredible however i will say that when you transfer out from the exchange into a you know an erc20 or a bep20 like binance smart chain token there is gas fees for that but if you're transferring straight into the proton wallet the xpr wallet you don't get charged a gas fee which is quite incredible i thought that was cool so verified identity so proton chain stores identity uh Astensions, forgive me if I'm pronouncing that wrong, by multiple identity providers, both for individuals KYC and business KYB. These identity providers can be um, queried with the user permission, built for stable coins, 4,000 transactions per second, which is getting up there to like XRP and XDC, which is cool. Users never pay gas. All user transactions are completely free. Send $20 to someone, uh, the person gets $20, you pay nothing at all. All resources, resources are handled by the app and extremely low tiered costs. This is incredible, guys. This is a real hidden gem here. In wallet payment request, app interact with the blockchain by in wallet payment requests. This revolutionary tech eliminates the need for Chrome plugins, dApps, stores, or other devices. Proton token, governance, resources staking you can stake them on the app as well short term or long term to obviously get that passive income if you wish it's just an incredible project guys and it's a real hidden gem so i'm going to get into my coin market cap now to show you what's going on in the portfolio in general so market cap sitting at one trillion dollars guys i'm not sure what's happened here that is a glitch and a half that's dropped significantly don't know why uh, 37 million dollars in trading volume billion dollars this has gone down significantly guys i'm not sure what's happening with this if it's a glitch anyway i'm going to go straight into my portfolio because i'm going to show you what's going on bitcoin is down today significantly 7.89 at 98 percent guys Sixty thousand us dollars it's shopped a lot but who knows what's going to happen this couple of days i don't see this as a problem because again if you go all time all time it's up 44 thousand percent that's what you need to do. Just zoom out. Don't look at the short term. Look at the long term. That's what I do. Great buying opportunities. Cardano, again, great buying opportunity. $1.93. Guys, look out again. 7,300%. XRP, $1.11. Guys, up 19,000% all time. That's what I love to look at. Again, Dogecoin, Shiba Inu, Polygon Matic, VeChain. Very bullish on this one as well. I'm going to be buying this. Still up 1,000% all time. In the last hour, it is down slightly. I'm not worried about that. Stellar XLM part of the ISO 222 compliance go all time guys and it is glitching right now but 13,000 percent I just saw it there there you go 13,000 percent I don't know man this is having a moment Tron is down today Theta Hedera again one I'm bullish on because of the governance in general so again it's up 361 percent all time 40 cents USD Decentraland Mana uh, Neo again, I like this project because it's like Ethereum based in China. Incredible, you know, project in general. Uh, it's up eleven thousand percent of all time. Sandbox, Amp, Hollow Chain, Theta Fuel, XDC Network. Very bullish on this. Nine cents USD, guys. Think about it. What's coming in twenty twenty five? Mind blowing stuff with this. It's two thousand four hundred percent up all time. Love this, guys. Tailcoin, ANKR, Searcoin, Digibyte, XYO. Again, hidden gem, guys, at $0.05 cents USD today, up 1,100% all-time. Crazy stuff. Winlink, Reef, VThor, Constellation, DAG, Proton. Now, $0.03 cents USD. That is a bargain for what this app actually is. Um, as I said, I don't promote anything that I'm not personally invested in. I did buy this on KuCoin, and uh, there's a couple of others that I'm looking at, but Proton XPR is a great project, guys. In the last 24 hours, it's slightly down like everything, obviously. Uh, in seven days it's up five percent in the last 30 days just wait for it to load down 28 percent 90 days it's up 659 percent so that's incredible as well 
Uh, what have we got here? Comey's down Electronium, part of the Digital Pound Foundation, guys. Again, go all time. Just wait for it to load. 68% of it is down. Well, that's interesting. That's only early, guys. In the last 90 days, 6.9% at one cent, guys. That's incredible. Acropolis, Ubix Network, still holding mine. Wait for it to load. If you go all time, it's up 14,000%. This one is a KuCoin gem on, um, obviously, KuCoin. The other one here, guys, is Pitbull, which I just threw in a gamble for me. So don't take this as financial advice. I just had a mate tell me just throw in some money here. And I've just been just keeping an eye on it, guys. This is a play for me pretty much like Shiba Inu was. So again, that's pretty much all my investments. I'm going to have a quick look at my three commas trading bot now while I'm here. It is down today because the market's quite flat. $1,815. It has made me $0.66, cents, obviously, right now. $364 USD total profits, which is incredible. I've got the one bot going, the dollar cost averaging bot. So check that out below. I'll link it, um, the, the referral link below if you want to check it out. And the video on how to set one up. It does trade. It's quite flat. It loves volatility. It's making me profits, guys. I can't complain about that. And again, 25 active deals. And I let it do its thing. I don't touch it. I, you know, sometimes I just let it sit in its deals for whatever time it needs. And again, I'm going to be taking profits out of this probably towards the end of this month because I've been leaving it now for nearly four and a half weeks. So uh, it's been really good, guys. I really enjoy this trading bot. It's been incredible so far. So that's pretty much it. Again, uh, you need a Binance account on here to use this. So set yourself up on Binance. Check out the referral link and the video on how to set it up. Any questions, leave me know in the comments. But that's pretty much in general, guys, uh, You know, an update for today. I just wanted to update you in, in terms of these projects, the ISO 222 compliant tokens, because it's going to be a game changer, guys. Honestly, this is happening. It's all happening, guys. 2025 is the new world that we're all going to be switched over to digital currencies. And these five projects here are the ones that are going to be flying. All right, so let me know in the comments below what you think about them. All right, stay safe, guys. Peace, bye.